Yeah. All right. So um, I'm Nate, and Xander, and Matt. Matt's going home. Yeah. Um, but he brought up a bunch of uh, liquid nitrogen, and we've been playing uh, with bubbles. So I just got some one of the mill bubble liquid. So they sit in there, and then the soap skim freezes to water ice, and then it pops. It just kind of lingers there after it pops. And I've been calling this a ghost bubble, and so if you get the tongs nice and cold, so that they're below the freezing point of water, you can then grab this thing and... No, not really. <laughs> very hard to get a hold of. <coughs> the act of blowing them trying to kind of blows them out of the area, but Sometimes you can get them to stick around in there. I don't even know if these show up on my camera. That's the, the temperature oh. layer where they're resting. Oh, and the wires there are from, we have a speaker under the engine right now. We're listening to music. Right, let's see if I can get a better view with this. I haven't figured out why the popped one is still buoyant at some layer. I think it might actually be acting like a boat hull. But I don't know. thing is if you try to grab one, your hand melts the water ice. So, the late night science at I3.